Do you need help looking for something in particular? No? You just want to check these items out. Okay, I can do that for you. So you have four items here. Okay, what I'll do, I'll just go through each item. Just make sure the discs are there and that you're happy with, with what you're about to purchase. Okay, yes, because this, this is a second-hand store. So I do have a tendency sometimes for things to go missing. Let's have a look. So the first DVD that you've chosen here, ah, this is a good one, Peter Kay's Car Share. I personally love Peter Kay. I think he is the funniest comedian of all time, well, especially British comedian anyway. Okay, so you've gone for this. This is the first series. Have you seen this before? No, but you've heard good things about it. Yes, it's won quite a lot of awards. It recently won um, the BAFTAs. It says, when a supermarket issues a new car share scheme, assistant manager John and promotions rep Kaylee are thrown together, forcing their paths to cross as they journey to work every day. But will they get along? Wonderful natural performances and beautiful witty writing makes this a joyous comedy that you'll want to watch time and time again. So there's that. So I'm just going to check that this is all there. Okay. So your disc is there. So you have a movie here. Oh, I really, I really like this movie. It's called oh, The Knowing with Nicolas Cage. Yes, I was really surprised actually how much I like this because um, I'm not a massive Nicolas Cage fan. In fact, I don't think I've ever seen a good film with him in it. <coughs> This is a really different movie. Have you seen it yet? No. Oh, well, I won't give you any spoilers then. But it's really different, and it, for me anyway, it kind of gripped me from the very first scene. And, you know, I'm trying to figure out what is actually happening. Um, so, yeah, let me just read you the back. It says Academy Award winner Nicolas Cage stars in Knowing. A gripping action thriller of global proportions about a professor who stumbles on a terrifying predictions about the future and sets out to prevent them from coming true. Rose Byrne um, also stars. Yeah, hugely exciting, gripping me from the start to the very end. Full blown, full on, spectacular movie. <clears throat> me. So, yes. We did check all the DVDs before we put them on the shelves, but you see, we like to just double check that they're still there when customers purchase them. Okay, so, yeah, this is a really interesting film. I think that you would enjoy it. Um, it just says, uh, what happens when the numbers run out? Quite a clever film, actually. Yeah. Moving on. Oh, <laughs> you just like me, you have a diff very wide range of films and things that you like. 
you can go from something like that to a Disney film just like me. You have Beauty and the Beast. Yeah. This is actually my all time favourite Disney movie. And you have yours too. Great. Okay. So, this obviously you know what Beauty and the Beast is because you've seen it, but I'm just going to read it anyway. It says, um, one of the most acclaimed and treasured animated films of all time is about to sweep you off your feet. Follow the adventures of Belle, a bright young woman who finds herself in the castle of a prince who's been turned into a mysterious beast. With the help of the castle's enchanted staff, Belle soon learns the most important lesson of all, that true beauty comes from within. Be our guest and let the music you'll never forget and the characters who will fill your heart cast a shimmering spell like never before. And this is a newer version and it's the digitally, I can never say that word, digitally, <laughs> digitally restored version. So it is HD, um, beautiful film. I'm just going to check that. Yeah. It's all there. Yep, and then the scratch free. This comes with, I believe, comes with quite a few little um, DVD extras. Um, well, it has a few extras. It has a f uh, bonus section. There's commentary. Um, a classic DVD bonus feature. Music, trailers, and three versions of the film. Hmm. Three versions of the film on that. So you've got that as well. And the last one here. This is awesome as well. You've got really great taste. <laughs> it comes with the IT crowd. This is the complete second series. So I presume that you already have the first series. You do? Perfect. Well, we do have all the series in stock. So if you are interested... Um, now or in the future you do have series I think there was five series uh, four series and then a special we do have all of them so yes this is the IT crowd the second series a brilliant British comedy um, let me just read the back here um, the IT crowd strikes back in the second series of the BAFTA nominated comedy. Um, hook up with geeks Roy and Moss plus relationships manager Jen as they embark on a whole new level of adventures, including a trip to the gayest musical ever, an appearance on Dragon's Den and a run-in with a German cannibal. And the reviews on here says... Magnificent, the funniest sitcom currently on television. We have some extras, some outtakes, commentary, and um, feature. So yeah, I think it's one of the funniest comedies of all time. I know that... Um, Good. Apparently, this because it was really popular in the UK, they made an American version of it. Apparently, it was um, yeah, like The Office as well. The Office was an English TV show, but then they they went on in America and they made their kind of own version of it. Well, the same with the IT Crowd, they did that, but the IT Crowd actually the American version, which I'd never actually seen. The American version actually featured Moss in it, and he was in the original anyway. I can't pronounce his name. Oh, Richard Arod, Arodi, something like that. The man who plays Moss actually featured in the American version too. And then obviously 
Chris O'Dowd went on to have quite a good career of his own. He was in Bridesmaids, but he was in this first where he kind of became famous anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, would you be interested in purchasing any of the other seasons of that at all today? No? You'll wait. Of course, no, not a problem. Okay, let me just scan these items here. So that will be £10 exactly then, please. Thank you very much. Okay, put that down there. And there is your receipt. And because we are a second-hand store, we also accept um, returns. So once you have watched the DVD and no longer want it, we can take it back and you can swap it for something of the same value. And get cash as well. You can get cash or store credit. Yeah, just bring your receipt along with your items. Up. 